Welcome aboard Carnival Cruise Line's newest ship that has just been transformed. Let's talk about this glow up here. We're talking, of course, about the Carnival Radiance. This is the West Coast newest ship here. They're offering three day voyages to Ensenada and four day voyages to Ensenada and Catalina Island quick getaways as Carnival Cruise Line is stepping up their game here with three ships now operating on the West Coast. We'll get into all the details with this ship tour showing you what this ship has to offer as they poured in so much to make this transformation so incredible. By the way, if you're new, my name is Alana Zingano from Travel the World A to Z, and I love to share with you all things cruising, so be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell so you don't miss another upload. Throughout the ship tour, we're gonna be looking at some new enhancements to the ship here and how things look really spanking brand new and different. So if you guys enjoy seeing, and first up being Big Chicken and along one of the many new offerings on board the Carnival Radiance here. So if you enjoy chicken, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. Let's go get started and see everything that the ship has to offer. And we have made it. Bok Bok, hello! Bok 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 Bok! <laughs> all right, we have all these beautiful chicken tenders, sandwiches, look at that, hot and ready for us. Yum, which would you like to have? the potato salad, house-made sweet and spicy pickles, the jalapeno with slaw. Oh yes, oh yes. But wait, there's more. Shack sauce, Memphis barbecue, barbecue ranch, buffalo hot and ketchup. This is incredible. Look at Shack's hands. How fun is that? And there's our life-size Shack. Oh, hello. <laughs> our life-size Shack. Here's some pictures of him. Guess what, this was on Mardi Gras. I was there. How fun. Las Vegas, see you on Carnival Celebration. Amazing, and there is his mama, Carnival Radiance. So she is going to be the godmother. This one is in Glendale, California. Eat life to the fullest. So all this seating here in the back of deck nine here in the after the ship for you to enjoy all of this delicious chicken outside. We're gonna have the ribbon cutting here in just a minute. And we have the pool. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty here at night with this lit up and the tides bar as well. So such a lovely space. And additionally, back here we have two pools. Check out the new ropes course up there with the funnel. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Get a load of this. Additionally here in the apps, Tide's Pool, the Jacuzzis and Whirlpools, the funnel, and guys pick an anchor up here, brand new to the ship as well. So a lot going on in the aft with the new ropes course, pool, guys pick an anchor, and shacks. All right, Pizzeria del Capitano. Currently not open uh, because this is the naming ceremony and guests aren't bored, even though it says 24 7. <laughs> Hello! Can't wait to try the pizza sometime! There we are. Uh, seating here as well for you to enjoy those slices along with Tide's Bar. So we have the Sports Square up there. Additionally, we have Guys Pig and Anchor. Just imagine with all the delicious barbecue options. Our smoke is no joke. Yum, yum, yum. Now let me know in the comments down below which one you would prefer here. Guy's Pig and Anchor, or Shaquille O'Neal's Big Chicken, or Guy Fieri's Burger Joint. And we haven't even made it over there yet. Lots of options for you though. We have this sports court, so basketball, wrapping around with the ropes course. You jump around from one thing to the other on here. They do have some lockers for you when you wanna do the ropes course, super fun. So it looks like you end and start at the same side down on here and come on down. 
All right, check this out. We have some muscle beach style fitness equipment here. Look at this, it's like an elliptical. I'd get on, but I'm in heels. <laughs> Let's take a look around as well. So it's the evening, obviously, so everything's lit up, looking pretty here with the terminal right there. And worth noting, we're on the jogging track. So it's exciting to see another ship here. We're about to see the Carnival Miracle actually pull out as well. And I think we might even have a bit of a horn battle as well. So not only do we have now the Carnival Radiance, the Carnival Miracle and the Carnival Panorama sailing from Long Beach. Super exciting to have all the options to choose fun. So we've made it to the Lido and straight ahead of us is Carnival Waterworks. So super fun, water slides here and a little splash pad and a small area for the littler tots. Let's go take a little closer look of what this looks like. So they have the little slide along with these little splash fountains here, fun. And since we are midship, we'll take you all the way down to deck five, where we will explore the fun shops. We have the Carnival Adventure Store, Cherry on Top, and get some shopping done because you know it's not a vacation unless you come home with a souvenir. Or is it? All right, so here we are, Pixels. You can see the photos. They'll print them here and they have them digitally as well on these kiosks. So if you enjoy the hunt, your photos will be put up here as well. Very dark Java blue. Freshly brewed coffee here, this is extra. Carnival Adventures. This is where you can book your shore excursion. Sunrise Restaurant here. Two floors for dining. Decorated for Christmas currently. Very pretty. So you can take a look. So they've changed all of all of this in here. It looks completely different. Uh, since I did sail the Victoria, I did remember uh, this is completely different here. Very, very pretty inside. Two-tone colors here with the chairs. Oh, wow, that's, that's sharp. Very nice. Let's head on over into the Liquid Lounge. This space was completely reimagined, which we'll see here it putting to work when you walk on in and how incredibly cool it is with the stage. The show that we're actually gonna get a sneak peek of is Rock Revolution, which is incredibly captivating. There's drones, spoiler alert, a lot of fun and really impressive here. So we'll get to jam out and see what it's like to catch a show.
head on over to the Caribbean inspired Red Frog Pub. This space is actually rather large and it wraps around with these great bars and also the area to listen to live music, which is really fun to get those Caribbean vibes to kick off your vacation. It even has some foosball tables in the back there and tons of seating to just enjoy and grab a drink here at the pub. Bonsai Sushi is also expanded and new for the Carnival Radiance here as well. They had this on the ship before, but it was just an express, and now it's a full-blown restaurant, which I think is fantastic. And I love this transformation of the Heroes Tribute Bar. This bar specifically salutes those that have served in the armed forces. And did you know that Carnival actually has more guests that are a part of the armed forces than any other cruise line? So something that is really nice to note that they take care of the military. Fahrenheit 555 is Carnival Cruise Line's signature specialty dining restaurant on board. I've had steak from their delicious fillets, juicy, tasty. I highly recommend if it's in your budget to sample a specialty dining restaurant. This is one that you won't want to miss. Now we are here at Wine Light Lounge. This is actually an interesting venue. It's multi-purposed here. So you'll actually have this as the nightclub, but also the venue for Punchline or Comedy Club. So fun to catch some laughs and break out some moves on the dance floor as well. What's also great is when you walked in, there's TV screens as well, because comedy shows on Carnival are always super packed. A definite crowd pleaser activity. So you have these screens, so really there's no bad seat in the house and you get to still be a part of the fun. So we are in the marketplace. Wow, it is gorgeous in here. So no food is out right now. It is late night, but gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous in here. They have a beer station for you. They also have all of your beverage stations. They also have the tables and buffet area as well. So this is where the seafood shack 
is an option for you as well. Here's the menu. This is an additional cost to have anything here. Keep on keeping on. Guy Fieri's burger joint here on the main pool deck. So let me know how you like your burger. Straight up plain Jane, the ringer. How you like it? Christine Duffy, the president of Carnival was saying that there needs to be a proper duel with Shaq and Guy's Burger. So we'll see how that goes. But the pool got a refresh here as well, out here on the pool deck. To our right, we have Red Frog Pub and Waterworks got a refresh as well here and Blue Iguana. So you can sit and wade here in the shallow water, just cool your feet, dangle in, enjoy movies under the stars here with the Jumbotron screen here. Oh, enjoy towel animals as well. How cute. Hello, my friends. Blue Iguana Cantina. They also have breakfast, so you can get breakfast burritos and everything like that here as well, along with your lunch options. So, burritos are you fancy? You can dine outside on the Lido here with this colorful option. And then here on the other side, oh, ooh, worth noting, soft serve. A marketplace, we have the Deli Artisan Eats hot and cold sandwiches for you. Chicken wraps, turkey wraps, falafel, lots of options. Another beer station, pour your own beer, 40 cents an ounce for that, not included in the beverage package. Next, we'll head on upstairs to Cucina del Capitano, and they actually have a really pretty glass elevator inside here as well. And here we are at Cucina del Capitano. Big chef kiss for this delicious Italian cuisine here on the ship. Check it out as it's a fun opportunity and lunch here is actually free when you dine in this specialty restaurant, but dinner is a service charge. Something to keep in mind if you wanna enjoy some extra dining options. Well, there you have it. I hope you have enjoyed this ship tour of the Carnival Radiance and got to see what it's like to roam the decks and explore some of the upgrades with this cruise ship here, the newest revitalized ship in Carnival's fleet. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to thumbs up and leave me a comment down below what your thoughts are or what you wanna see next. Check out these other two videos that I just know you will enjoy as well. And until next time, ciao for now.